Hey everybody, this is Eric. Um, back in the hangar again. Oh wow, we got the compressor in the background. Let's see if we need to edit this out. Cut. Um, <coughs> sorry. Cut. Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Eric with uh, Hanging in the Hillbilly Hangar on Aviator in Illinois YouTube channel. So uh, appreciate you tuning in and stopping by. So just going to cover a few things here. Uh, closing up and getting close to finishing up these uh, ribs, which is aviation art, and trying to go over in my mind what I want to do with this space um, with the hanger. So I got a, uh, I got some stuff I'd like to, you know, this stuff here is going to go hopefully on this little project here, but got some other stuff that, ooh, that's a bright light up there, hanging out. Uh, some other bits and pieces and I hang around. So let me turn you around here and show you what I'm talking so about. So as I was saying before, it's finishing up on these oof, ribs. And man, I'll be glad to get through that. Holy crap. There's four right there and there so uh, hanging in the hillbilly hanger <laughs> so put some more shellac second coat on this one here and as soon as i finish this up and go edit it uh shellac's here lacquer thinner clean the brushes after you're done anyway got two got two three joints gluing up here clamped together drying uh wax paper between them keep it from gluing itself together. A couple of little gussets up here, a little bit of remaining material there. Over here, this is sheet metal going on the landing gear and the fuselage on the steerman. Over here with the jig I mentioned earlier to put the curve and the bow on the wing tip. A couple more pieces here. I do have a couple more pieces to finish up. More gussets, make sure, I think I'm done. I can put them in the box. This is just filler material here. Get all this put together. Uh, and I did work on the right flyer. I will drop it. All broken up. So I'll put the rest of this material in there and then file it on the shelf. Um, what I was talking about earlier is trying to make this a man cave hanger is this will be the automotive section although it's kind of got some plumbing parts in it bunch of steerman parts wheels tires Ooh, had a brain fart there uh, landing gear uh, magnetos some other stuff there's a fiberglass one I do have an aluminum one that was crushed but I that I redid Maybe I'll find some pictures of that. I don't know. Uh, mixture, throttle, quadrant, bulkhead, fixtures, tail wheel, I don't know. Just airplane stuff. Um, all airplane stuff. That was hanging on the wall and it's fell and I've just been so disappointed. I haven't even looked at it yet. I know it poked a hole in it. So, get done with the ribs Whew. six months wow we're still that for six months that's crazy um anyway so be done with this i'm gonna take a picture downstairs and show you i think i have I don't know, half a dozen seven or eight i thought i was only going to get seven or eight but i did manage to patch i had 12. uh so i'll make some kind of arrangement on the wall and do that but i'm going to try to uh, make a, if you got any suggestions on what needs to go where other than just tidy it up, the, the door, this whole wall is the door, so that's a tough one. Um, that shelf will probably go back in that corner with another one over there and then just have oil and things, you know, in that corner for automotive. Um, yeah, oh, my lay wheel. So, let's go try to mount 
I don't know, I think I have two sets of those to mount a couple of vertical there. Hopefully that'll be coming down in the near future, this coming year, 2023. That's another project sitting there waiting on me. Um, Got to put some of this stuff on eBay and get it sold. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much an update where I'm at. Oh, got spare parts there for the patch on that up there. That's some expensive airplane parts. So try and get those on eBay, get them repaired, get them on eBay and uh, keep going on here. So that's it for right now. Let me see if I can get some of this edited. And uh, then we will try to post something. It's been whew, six months. Huh? Yeah, sorry about that. You know, I know we all, all 20 of my subscribers have been anxiously awaiting, but we'll see how it goes. And uh, hopefully pick up the pace here a little bit more. So got winter coming on and get into some winter projects. See ya.